Ooh, what's up, everybody? My name is JJ Flies, and today we're going to be talking about King DDD. Okay, so, unless, uh, let's, let's come on. so unless, uh, I don't upload this on time, uh, Sora comes out today. Uh, expect, like, uh, another video, uh, uh, another video later on. Uh, Sora comes out today, which means patch 13.0.0 comes out, uh, and I kind of, I kind of want to just make, like, a quick, uh, DD video about what I want to get, uh, buffed for him, uh, because I'm hoping for buffs for DD, because if you don't know I made the character, um, we're just gonna start right into it, um, number one thing I want... Uh, for DDD get in this next patch is a kill throw because with no DI, uh, he just none of his throws kill until like it is at the ledge, too. Which, like, none of his throws kill for a while. So, uh, look at this 130, uh, fourth throw, no pummel, fourth throw does not kill, one pummel does not kill, uh, back throw not kill. He's like, uh, DD shouldn't have a kill throw at a uh, down throw. DD should not have a kill throw at uh, at, uh, at one thirty is what you're thinking. And like, yeah, I would agree, I guess. But like, every other super heavy rate can ha has a kill throw like around there. Look at this. Uh, DD at ledge four throw. Mario with no DI kills at one fifty. And that looked fake as fuck. I busted out my uh, second controller just to uh, what's this? Is this working? Yeah. So. I'm gonna even show y'all that this move does not kill. Okay. So now I'm gonna hold left with Mario. Then move does not kill. It doesn't even get close to killing. Did you guys see that? It does not even get close to killing. But I'll do. I'll do the back throw. I'll do back throw too, just to just to show you. Uh. Boom. It'd be the same way you do, uh, it literally like the, like, the worst angle to possibly kill. It's not kill whatsoever. So bad. So bad. Eevee cannot kill with a throw, and it, like, actually bothers me. Does this even kill at 180 at ledge? Please tell me it does. Okay, it does. Okay, it does. Back throw. Does back throw kill it? No, back throw does not kill. <laughs> What's the point of this throw? Back throw doesn't kill at 180. Why? Forward throw barely killed, I think. Forward throw doesn't kill. <laughs> this character doesn't have a kill throw at 180. You telling me that's okay? So, anyways, okay. So, what I want for them to do is. For first of all, let's let's like let's like uh put this on normal. So like like at mid percent, like at, let's say sixty. I want four throw. I want the angle to be like uh, slightly more down. Like if I do four throw, uh, let's say eighty. If I do four throw. I want more to be uh sent down a little bit further down, so I can run off an edge guard. Cause like so I I, I can have like at least a better attempt at edge guarding. Cause like look at this, ZD's already slow. So I think if they make the angle go down, it's not like it's gonna change too much. Cause it's it's already hard to hit people unless like they just wanna recover low and then it's easier. But like if they jump, it's like kinda hard. Even then it's like kinda hard because DD's airspeed is like super slow. And like I don't care if they like, don't change at all, but like make it easier for uh for me to like catch people when I when I throw them off the stage. And um back throw, I want back throw to have the kill treatment. I want that thing to go straight. I want that thing to go straight hor horizontally. I want that thing to kill out like at 140 instead of this. You can't get anything off of this. Like back throw is like the worst throw by far to me. Because like every other throw has its uses. Like down throw is like a it's like a combo uh move at like every percent. Like almost every percent. Um up throw uh, at early percent you get up throw up air. Which is, um, it won't work now because it's not early turns. But, like, even then, like, you can also try to, like, kill people with cheese people. Not to mention that you can also down throw up air. So, down throw is always good to be up air. Uh, up throw is good, uh, from, like, 0 to 40 or something like that. 
It just depends on the character. So, I think that's uh, a good change you should get. I think they should either. Uh, I'm not saying I want fourth or to kill because I think they'll be busted if I'm if I get somebody off stage and I got a Gordo at ledge and they're in there on ledge. I have a Gordo and then they just neutral get up shield and then I just and I just grab them. I, I don't. I, I, I would like that. That would be pretty good. But like, if they don't want to give DD kill throw a forward throw, then just make it do back throw. That way, if I if I want to back throw the kill, I have to somehow get them like this and then do that. Like, I think that would be pretty cool. That'll be. I think that would be a really good, fair and balanced buff. Um, what else is there? Let's look at all his moves. Up B. I think Up B's fine. I wish the star. I wish the star had a little bit more hit stun. So, um, if somebody hits the star, I can't get punished for it, because that happens all the time. Uh, let's see if I can actually, uh, let's see if I can actually punish DDD for getting hit with the star, by, by getting hit with the star. That was a shockwave. What do I do? Is it shockwave? Okay, I'm not going to try. It's hard to do with two controllers. But I'm pretty, I've gotten punished more times than you could think, uh, by, uh, getting, by hitting people with the, uh, star. Like, they're shielding when I do this, and then they, they drop shield, and they get hit with the star, and, but then I still get punished, and I, 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 don't think, I, think, I don't think that's fair. Also, um, call me crazy, but, um, Yoshi's, uh, up, uh Yoshi's down B and Bowser's down B, uh, shield breaks? I don't know, man, I think, I think these shield breaks, they're like, because if you're getting hit, like, if you're getting hit by the, by the whole up B, like, I think it should just shield break. I mean, and maybe that's just calling me optimistic, but like Yoshi's, the Yoshi's down B shield breaks, uh, Bowser's down B shield breaks. I don't know. I think it's only fair, but uh, that's just me. Uh, I think neutral B is fine. I think if inhaling a projectile, uh, like inhaling a projectile back on neutral B, he should just spit it out like instantly. Uh, I think that would be a uh, like, like, he, like he takes a long to spit it out, so like it's like. So easy to like see it coming and then just shoot it or something. They should just make that shit instantaneously. It's a cartoon game. It's a, it's a cartoon character. It could look funny. Uh, but yeah, that shit's not fair. That shit's not. Uh, I don't like it. I think they should buff it. Um, Gordo, <sighs> Gordo. They they should. The threshold for this move is like so small. Like uh, how much does Mario's jab one do? Two point seven. That knocks back Gordo. I feel. I know I said I'm not gonna do two controllers, but I'm gonna do this actually. Look at that! Look at that! It just knocks it back. I feel like the threshold. The threshold is like 1.7. Uh, what's a, what's another one of Mars' weak moves? Uh, I don't really know. I don't really know what Mario's weak moves are, but like, it's just not fair. I think it's just not fair. Like a jab one. Jab one's not. Mario's jab one that does, as we saw, does 2.7 percent. I don't think that's fair. I don't. I, I think I think it should be like the threshold should be like five percent. I think five percent is, is fair because like in Mario's near does eight percent. Mario's uh up here eight percent. Uh down down there is a multi. I don't think I don't like how I don't think multi it should knock my Gordo either. It's just me. Forward air, 15%. Uh, back air, 11%. Uh, what else is there? Neutral B, 6%. You see, if this knocks it back, uh, I'll hate it. But um, I think it's fair, I guess. Um, what else is there? Or said I'll be no, I'll be uh, no, Mario will never do that anyway. Zares, like for example, characters with Zares, they should the Zares should not knock it back. I'm gonna switch real quick. A character with a Zare, like let's say Samus or Young Link. Uh, Young Link is a little bit more popular, so we'll do Young Link. Young Link's Zare, where is Young Link? Young Link Zare should not bring should not uh, uh knock order back. I'm just saying it doesn't make sense to me. Does not make sense at all to me. Just the grab button here. This. So I have to do this. Okay. Out of the game. Out of the game. Oh, this is hard. Okay, we'll. No, I'm showing this off.
Well, I have to use this controller. Oh, that's dumb. Oh, this is hard. Uh, we'll turn this off. We'll just. <sighs> oh, it's. Eh. <sighs> look at that! Look at that! Look at that! <laughs> It's not fair. It, oh, it does five percent exactly. Okay, I think Gordo should. Uh, I think Gordo. <laughs> I think Gordo's threshold should be uh five point one percent actually, because you know I think that's super fair and balanced. Uh, how much do Samus do actually? Don't mind me. Don't mind me. Uh, very professional video right here. Um, making a lot of valid points. Uh, I'm not editing anything by the way, so take it what it is. Mr. Last can go on a test. How much is Samus' air does? Then we'll go back to more moves, I guess. It's a double hit, isn't it? Oh, it's not. Okay, this is 3%. See, that's fair. That's fair. They should make Young Link's air weaker. Also, Samus' air should not knock my Gordo. That's still dumb. Let's do this, right? Three. Yeah, I, don't, I I think that should not work, but it does. Uh, forward tilt. I think um, they should make forward tilt. Okay, here's my issue. They should make forward tilt either. They should make either forward tilt. Let me show them here. They should make forward tilt either safer or kill. You don't have to do both. Just reach. Oh, actually, I actually have to manually input it. I'm not gonna do that. That's too much. If it was my own controls, I could do it. But I feel like F tilt's not that safe. I feel like it's not as safe as it should be, and that bothers me. If it was safer, then I'd be fine. Or if like the move was bigger, like because if you look at this move, like D to D, like. He holds it like also D's hand right there is a is a heart box, so he can get hit right there. But they should make like they, they should change the animation to like where the D holds the hammer like further away, so the move is like a little bit further. And if they shoot it when it's when the move like 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 extend the move to like like uh where like the line the next line is like the next line on FD like the little black line, not the pink line, the black line. That's that's how far the move should go. If they made the move go maybe even a little bit further than that. They should make the move go that far. That way, if somebody shields it, it'll be way harder for them to punish and uh, give the move less in lag so I can, like, actually protect myself. Because I don't know. I feel like the move isn't safe. But if you don't want to go that route, you can also just allege if you just force it. Like, they should make the move, like, not kill as late as it does. How, how late does it kill with no DI? Kills, I'll say, 160. I don't know for sure. Doesn't kill at 160. Wait, maybe? No, it doesn't kill at 160 with no DI. Which means with DI, I don't kill to like 185 probably. Which is bad. That's actually bad. <laughs> okay, that actually did kill. But still, it kills super late. It kills super late, like for no reason at all. Like, at that point, I'd rather just F throw. <laughs> you know how F throw. <laughs> you see the issue with that because F throw. I I am a super heavy. I shouldn't have to. I shouldn't have to. Like, I am a super heavy. We just now got up tilt kills and up air kills. Those moves used to didn't kill, by the way. Those moves did not used to kill. But I I would like more kill moves. Uh, at least an easier time killing, especially Gordo sucks ass. Uh, down tilt, uh, down tilt's fine. I think I like down tilt, uh, at low percent, it sends at a tech chase situation, or, or I can jab like people if they don't tech. Oh, I guess some people, not some characters, not other characters. Um, neutral B, um, besides the inhaling projectiles, I think that's fine. Uh, dash attack, I think it's fine. Forward smash. There's like a bug for forward smash to where like if Samus is like if Samus is like in This area if I'm forward smashing like right above deity 
sometimes Forward Smash just, like, will, like, drag Samus down to the ground, but then, like, the, the like, the, the actual hit won't connect. They should, they should fix that bug, but, um, Forward Smash is fine, Down Smash is fine, uh, Up Smash is fine, I mean, yeah. If you want me to have some type of buff, they can make, uh, Down Smash a little bit faster, or a little bit stronger, or... I don't know, I think down smash would be his worst smash attack. Actually, I have to actually think about it. Up smash might be it. I don't know. These smash attacks aren't really that good. They're like in a certain situation, but like, they're nothing fantastic, and I'm fine with that. Uh, just want like a little forward tilt buff, uh, forward throw, back throw buff, uh, Gordo threshold to be a little bit more, but besides that, I think Gordo's a good move. Uh, I mean, I think it can be. I think it can be a good move. It's a good move on DD. In general, it's a bad move, but it's a good move on, on DD. Uh, up throw, I mean, up B, I think uh, it should break shields just because me, Brawler, head on assault can break shields. Uh, Yoshi down B breaks shield. Bowser down B breaks shield. Somebody else's move probably breaks shield when it shouldn't. DD doesn't. So dumb. Um, where are the moves there? Back throw, back at. Uh, Back air is fine. I can make it like a frameless ending. Like, <laughs> no, let me stop. I'd be super down if they want to do that. And air is fine. Up air is fine. Down. This move sucks. Down air actually sucks. But you know what? I don't even know what they could do to fix it. That move sucks. Down air sucks bad. I don't even know how they would fix it. Uh, make like the. It doesn't have a spike hitbox unless they're unless they're airborne. And then, like, I don't know. Let me see. I don't know. I don't really know how to fix that move. I just don't think it's that good. But I don't think it's really that bad either. I just think there's no reason to do this move. And, like, when you, like, if that happens, I might as well, I might as well just do fair. And fair is just stronger. Or back, or back here. Like, there's no reason to take the risk. Because you have to, like, hit them at a certain angle, which would be hard. It would be hard if your opponent knows or even remotely what they're doing. Um, I think I said every move. Jet Hammer. Um, they should make Jet Hammer to where I can use all of my jumps. <laughs> no, they shouldn't. Um, sometimes, actually. I think, um... Lately, sometimes when I play... Is it this? Yeah. Sometimes when I play DV, um, Jet Hammer doesn't actually break shields. That bothers me. Sometimes it doesn't. Yeah. Okay, it did that time. Sometimes I do it. Sometimes I do it uh, when I play Elite Smash. Oh, I'm a god without even trying. And it like almost breaks shield, but doesn't. And it like bothers me so much. But I, I, I don't know. I'm just bad at the bubble. Yeah, like that right there. Like I think Jet Hammer, fully charged Jet Hammer, should just always break shield, even if you. Is that a thing, like, where you, like, show up the perfect time? Not not parrying, where you, like, show it, like, is that, like, perfect shielding or something? I think even if you perfect show Jet Hammer, your shield should break. If that's even a thing. Um, but yeah, I think, I think that's about it. Um, I've been... I hope you enjoyed this, uh, like, 20 minutes of me saying what they should buff for DD. I think DD is a fine, can be a fine character. Are there people shooting outside? What's wrong with these people? Um, I think D has the potential to be way better than he is if they fix these few things. I think D will like shoot up. So I don't think he's bad. I think he has good matchups for like some of the better characters. Like I think he does pretty good against Snake. Um, there's like some matchups like I might I might make a matchup chart one day. There's like some matchups where um like he loses, but like it's minus one and like a minus one match for D means that like you're like you're losing it, but like. You can you can pull through like minus one matchup like I'm not saying like I'm not saying DD beats Mario but like I would pick DD against Mario uh, just because like the matchup doesn't feel impossible actually Mario's kind of a bad example actually no I would pick DD against Mario because I don't know Mario's I used to think Mario just completely destroys DD but like every Mario I fought like if they do beat me it doesn't feel like it's a complete wash. Uh, Ness, I think DD beats Ness. Um, uh, that's for another story. Um, every DD has a hot text on who DD beats and who DD doesn't beat. Like, um, um, uh, what's his name? 
one thing he went to uh summit uh i can't think of his name it's tired i worked 12 hours today but he thinks dd beat snake i think he is at least even in that matchup just because um D is suck this this is there's only like five characters who i like who i definitely do not want to use dd against um but the other matchups is like it sucks but like i feel like I, i'll try it but I think that's it. Uh, if you want to see you do a DD matchup chart, uh, let me know. Um, I'm dropping this character probably. Uh, I say this. I'm going to try and drop DD if he does not get any buffs in the next few hours. Because this, I'm, I'm recording this video uh, the night before Sora comes out. But this video comes out on Sora comes out. It'll probably come out like six hours before Sora comes out or something like that. But if DD doesn't get buffed at all, I'm going to try to drop him. Uh... I'm gonna try Sora out, see if I like Sora. So make sure you come to the channel for my Sora content. Um, if I don't like Sora, I'll be a pirate myth remain. Uh, Min Min secondary, perhaps? I don't know. I think that's a good spread right there. But um, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Like, comment, and subscribe. Your support is, excuse me, greatly appreciated. And I will see you guys. In like two hours if you want to watch me do um one final elite smash video with ddd before um i know his fate and then if you're still watching the video i might no promises i might stream uh a little bit of smash ultimate uh tonight uh just playing sora not sure though don't quote me um I saw if you're still here, sometimes I'm thinking about it. Uh, character I want to be buffed. Uh, I'll probably make a post on my Twitter uh, for SCJJ for life, I think. Uh, characters I want to be changed. I want them to buff the Mies. I like Mies. I want them to be busted. Uh, buff the Mies. Uh, buff Prana Plant. Uh, I, I can't tell you why I don't play these characters. I just want them to buff these characters. Buff the Mies, buff Prana Plant, uh, buff DDD. Uh, I want, I actually kind of want Pit to be good. Pit, I feel like Pit, Pit could be like super fun if they were good. So buff them. Uh, nerd, buff, make, make some change to Daisy to make her slightly different from Peach. I don't care what, just, just make it different. I don't really want them to nerf anybody. Uh, I guess they won't nerf the rat. Uh, I'm kind of broken on Joker, but I don't really care. Uh, I don't know. I don't. I don't really want them to nerf too many characters. Uh, delete this character right here. Um, but yeah, I think that's about it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys next time. Um, yeah, I've been um distracting off for like five minutes. So yeah. See you guys later. Bye-bye.